Hello preppers and YouTubers. Uh, thanks for joining me on this short video. We're just looking at one of the old mag lights. This is one of the 3D cell mag lights with the old bulb before they came out with LED technology. Just wanted to do a quick comparison against the standard uh, newer lights with the 18650 rechargeable lithium ion batteries uh, with higher outputs. Uh, this one's around 400 lumens and uh, I have no idea what the older ones were, but I guarantee it was probably, a, you know, uh, probably 40 to 50 lumens, and you know, just with the old bulbs. Of course, the newer LED uh, uh, mag lights, especially in these uh, these types of configuration, the larger ones, uh, do put out considerably more light, and, and they have some uses. But I think the new form factors, though, with the smaller lights, uh, and of course using a, a collapsible baton, is probably a better system overall. I just wanted to ask your opinion and see if how you felt about that. Uh, would you carry this system or go with this system? Um, I feel like that you can, uh, you know, break this system up, obviously put these on your belt uh, and then having something this large on your belt. Of course, there's always the people who say, well, when you have the two in one, like the mag light, all you got to do is just flip it around and you got the weapon or the self-defense tool already there. Instead of having to dig into your utility belt as a police officer would to deploy this uh, uh, collapsible baton. Especially if you're a civilian, though, you might have that collapsible baton uh, inside the waistband, inside of, a, of a, maybe a cargo pocket, which is even more difficult to get out quicker, or a jacket pocket. So it just really depends on uh, your situation and how and what your needs are. So I just wanted to, to do that and do this quick little review. And uh, I really enjoy mag lights, uh, have for many years. I just don't use them anymore. And while they do have a, a whole new line of, uh, of new, smaller, compact, and tactical style, uh, and they're very cool. I do like a lot of those. Well, at least some of them. Um, they seem like they're still always behind one step in terms of the evolution of LED technology and, uh, and their designs. But they are getting better. I just hope that they can catch up fully uh, because uh, there's just so many other options out these days. It's a, it's a concern that maybe one day they won't be able to maintain their, uh, their status within the lighting world. So as always, I thank you for, your, uh, for all your comments, and I'll catch you real soon.